Hello and welcome to Let's Play Beneath the Still Sky. We're... <laughs> Be quiet, please. Thank you. Don't you go and turn it back on. Let's Play Beneath the Still Sky with me, Mr. McCluckable. In the last episode, we... well, we escaped from certain death. We met Hobbins. Uh, we learned a bit about Union City and how high up we are and how there's a computer that aids the government and lots of other dodgy stuff. Um, we also saw this cupboard here. Hmm. I want to get, not you, I want to get in this cupboard. Unfortunately what happens when I try Smart to design. is... What are you doing? Get out! That's my personal property! Yes, that. And also, I just realised the volume's back gone back to normal. We want that a bit lower. There we go. I've also I can't tell if the speed's different from last time, but I think the speed resets every time I reload the game, which sucks. I'll try and get it the same every time, but it's this speed there, thereabouts. Okay, so Joey. Last episode, right at the end, we saw Joey had an option to uh, distract the maintenance man. So let's see if we can do that. Can you distract that maintenance man? What do you suggest? A song and dance routine? A few conjuring tricks? Now you're being silly. Yeah. He does that quite a lot. Um... About that temporary shell, Joey. I don't want to talk about it. Fine. Oh well, do we want to find him a new shell? I'll find you a new shell, I promise. I should hope so. Marvelous. I get kidnapped, nearly killed in a copter crash, hunted by professional thugs, and I'm stuck with a robot in a sulk. I know. It, it, we're not in the best of situations, are we? Could We could use a little like support here from our friend, our robotic friend, but instead he moans. He moans. Um, Forget it. Yeah, enough of you, Joey. If you're not going to help us... Right, we've got to think of other ways to get to that door. I mean, I don't even know if it's useful, but the fact that it's guarded makes me think it is. Um, we had a look at all these. What else does he have Excuse to say? Me. What now? Oh, fine. I'll get on with you. No do other, that. no other options to oh to look at. Tree world. See the world as your ancestors saw it. <laughs> I think that shows how bad the, uh, 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 what's the word? This <laughs> environment is. No trees. Insurance certificate. Years out of date. Oh dear, Hobbins. Oh dear, oh dear. Um, I think we looked at all this last time. Right. Now, oh, before we go any further in the game, let me say this. If you like the look of this game, go and play it yourself, because it's free. It's under um, open license, um, no copyright, anything like that. You can get it on, um, um, well, I'm playing on Scum at the moment, Scum VM. But you can also play it on GOG.com. That stands for something, but I can't remember what. Gamers online, I don't know. But yes, it's on there, free to download. So yes, have a go if you want. Alright, so... Uh, the man, he did come out when we went on this. An elevator to the floor below. Yeah, go on it. Now, I wonder if we can beat him back to the room. I told you to stay off the elevator. Ready? That alarm is driving me spare. Yeah, okay, shut up. Let me go. Go, 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 go. Where's the... But... Right, see if we can beat him while he's fiddling around with that. Out of the way, Joey. Oh, no, he's on his way back. Quickly, open the cupboard door. Take, 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 whatever that is. Take it. Oh, I closed it instead of picking it up. What did that even say? I wasn't focusing. What did we get? A wrench. Hmm. The tool is a standard 30mm wrench. Give me an analysis, Joey. It's a 30mm wrench. 
and you can keep it away from my nuts. Oh, oh my. <laughs> um, there was one other thing in that cupboard. I want to get it. It was... I was... I was too quick. I was panicking. The angry man's after me. I wanted to grab that second item. So let's do that again. No, oh, not again! Yes, again. Are you trying to wind me up? Uh, not exactly. God. Flipping inspectors! Yeah, okay. Go, go. Go and do your little thing. I wish you could run. <laughs> now is really the time to run. Right. Let's try that again. Open that. Oh, it's a sandwich! <laughs> the meat is mostly fat and gristle, which appears to be in the early stages of putrefaction. I don't want to eat that. Why does he want to eat that? Well, yeah, he did say it was a lunch, didn't he? I should really pay attention to what he says. What? Give me an analysis. Give me an analysis, Joey. Yeah. It contains flour, water, vegetable oil, salt, egg, garlic, with glycerin and pig lungs. Oh, disgusting. Yeah, that's not as nice. The pig lung, maybe. Uh, right. Did we ever figure out what any of these do? Do we even need to use them? I don't know, but let's go explore for a little bit. We've just stuck to that room. I'm sure we could have went another way. Perhaps. And now we've got a wrench, so what can we use this... Oh. I wonder if we can fix that robot with the wrench. No, what, what is it? It's not a robot, it's a transporter. Let's see. There's no obvious reason why this droid isn't working. Yeah. There doesn't appear to be anything wrong with it. Let's just try the wrench on it, see what happens. Okay, there's no sound bit for that, that's fine. I'm not saying this game is perfect, it's very old. Some sound bites are missing. Oh, can Joey Can do you it? start that transport? How do you expect me to do that? I'm just a cleaning droid, remember? It's the, uh, Knopfler Charge Reducer thingy. In that case, all it needs is a jump start. Go on, then. This is embarrassing, Foster. You're not gonna watch, are you? <laughs> I always suspected you of being a voyeur. Come on, just do it. Shield your Here eyes. Goes. Ew. There. How was it for you? <laughs> uh, I do like Joey. Forget it. Okay. What's that actually done? It started moving. Where's it going? Oh, there it is. Let's follow it. Hope that thing's got sensors. A guy could get hurt if it hit him. Oh! Oh, he's picking up drums. I see. Can we go in that bit? Can we climb down there, perhaps? That panel in the floor looks like an elevator. Yes, yes, yes. It doesn't look as if it would bear my weight. Oh. That... Okay, let's see what he does with these drums. I'm guessing he puts them on the elevator. But then, can I go on the elevator with it? Where does the elevator lead to? Who knows? So many questions. Okay, we know that if we stand on that, it's going to go off the alarm. So... I want to see what actually happens Pretty when he puts... And a keyhole. But no sign of a key. Hmm. I want to see what actually happens when he puts a drum on here. So let's just wait for a second. Do -do -do. So how are you today? Oh really, that's good. Nice weather. Mm hmm Lovely. Okay. We've been having horrible weather here, if that makes any difference. Ah, oh, he's back. Do right. Let's have a quick check. Hole! Hole! There's a hole now! Go down the hole! <gasps> yes! He actually did it! 
Oh dear, what's that? <gasps> oh dear, we've been caught on camera. We've been... Let's have a look. That thing's watching me. Mm. Good thing I'm naturally photogenic. Yeah, I'm not... Just a few pixels, mate. I'm not sure about that. Alright, is that going to kill us or whatever? It looks a bit dodgy. <gasps> There's Joey. He can fly? Why would a vacuum cleaner need to fly? Hmm. Alright, let's have a look at this lock and the door. Let's get out of this place. No buttons, just a thin slot. Oh, furnace. Don't think we really want to go in there. But it's worth a look. Some oven. Wonder what's cooking. I don't know. Whatever's in those barrels. Toxic waste, probably. Mr. Burns style. Um, That's got to be a way out. Okay, can we... Oh, man. Oh, here we go. Okay, it's scrap. What scrap? This must be where the scrap gets melted. Is that why you brought me here? Don't worry, kid. They'd only take premium quality scrap. Ooh, burn. <laughs> I see it's scrap metal, yes. Um... You didn't tell me you could fly. I didn't know I had it in me. That's nice. Think this could be a way out? Through the furnace? I don't rate our chances. If you can't be sensible, be quiet. But then we are about to ask him a question as well. I think we're being watched. They seem to think you're someone special. I can't imagine why. What? Where'd you get that from, Joey? How do they think we're special? Can you open that door? I'll give it a try. Oh yeah, go for it. Do a little R2-D2 thing. No sudden moves over, man. Get over to the furnace. Oh crap. Oh no, that did not go well. You're Officer Reich, I presume. You've made a mistake. I'm not Overman. Link, we can't let him escape. Holy what the hell is going crap. on? Reich seems pretty cut up about it. But he's given me two leads. Overman and Link. Possibly the most inappropriate time for a pun there. <laughs> yeah, this game has a bit of gore. Look at that. It's even got blood splats and everything. Let's have a look. Barbecued. I'll never eat kebab again. Oh. Oh, yeah. Robert Foster is not the most subtle of uh, people. <laughs> Alright, let's just search the corpse. He was carrying an ID card. Ooh. The card may be useful. And I'll take his dark glasses, too. Now we're just now we're just looting corpses. Why don't you take his clothes while you're at it? Uh, what did we just get? Ah. This plastic card bears the only... Bears only the security logo. Okay. Joey? Give me an analysis, Joey. What? Sorry. My anti-stress circuit was engaged. It's an ID card in the name of Reich. Anti-stress circuits? I could use one of those. Sounds quite nice. And what about these? I know these are just glasses, but still. Give me an analysis, Joey. Of those shades? Yes, go on. They're broken. <laughs> oh no. So we can't even wear them. Oh, that sucks. Right. Well, goodbye, Reich. How long is your buddy going to do that for? I don't know, but someone will find you, I'm sure. Ooh. Okay. We're outside now. Are we outside? I can't really tell. We're way up in the clouds, Joey. We need to find a way to the ground. Okay, we are, yes, because that's like, that's like buildings in the background. And as he just said, we are in the clouds. So we've got 
Oh, we've got a few ways to go now. We've got to the left, to the right. We've got this room. Let's go in here. Hmm. Are these people going to be after us? Obviously not. Yes. I'd like to... Is this regarding a domestic incident? I've been transferred from domestics. I have this tendency to get emotionally involved. You're too sensitive, Sam. It's my nature, Norville. It's <laughs> not about a domestic. That's a relief. Um... <laughs> Alright, I don't know what that, that was about. Let's try Norville. Yes? I'd like a few answers. Yes? How do I get down to ground level? Who is Overman? You can get information from the Link Terminal. Just who are you, anyway? I'm here to inspect the building. Yes? That's right. Routine inspection. Yes? Heard anything about an inspection, Sam? What kind of an inspection, Norville? A routine inspection. Routine, oh? Phew. That's unusual. It's not convenient right now. Quit pestering me when I'm busy. Well, these two sure are strange people. Also, isn't it weird how this game is set in Australia and yet everyone has a British accent? <laughs> That's very odd. Um, so that. He did give us some useful information, I suppose. Let's have a... Ah, oh, that's the terminal. Okay. Let's have a quick look at this. I'm guessing... It's a link terminal. Yeah, turn it on. No, don't go there. Have a look at this. It's a link terminal. Hmm. Let's try the card. I'm pretty sure the card works. Or just, just go out the door. That's good. There we go. Aha! So this is a way to get some news. Maybe not some answers though. What have we got? Personal. Stephen Reich? Oh yeah, this is his card. Um, Bellevue Gardens 2291. Balance of account $6,000. Link status 5. Uh, recent transactions. Oh, what, what has he just bought? Frank, Frank's Exotic Fisheries. Uh, motor services and dangerous bikes subs. Right. Yes. <laughs> what about this? Oh, what does that say? Gazetta. So this must be like the adverts. Worried about your future? We offer fully comprehensive policies to safeguard your status. Anchor insurance. Hmm. Why is Betty the centre of attraction? She's wearing the latest in fashion. Bakelite lip plates supplied and fitted. <laughs> Um, the club in the park, St. James's. When you get there, you'll know you've arrived. Right, Hyde Park. They got a Hyde Park. I thought it was in Australia, not London. Suspicious of your neighbours? Turn your paranoia to hard cash. Contact Neighbourhood Watch Scheme. And amaze your friends with our accessories. Safe hermaphro surgery techniques. What the gel of no? Okay, and fine. Oh well, not fine, I guess, but. Um, oh, oh, so this must be actual news. Hobart Looney's at, at it again. It has been confirmed that the introduction of a mystery virus into Link was the work of left wing activists, blah blah blah, from Hobart City. The virus caused an error which led to the termination of over 32 residents. Okay, Link's a computer, right? That's what, that's what Hobbins told us. And there's a virus on the loose. That's not safe. Property theft figure saw. Do, do, do. Uh, I'm just I'm just skipping through these really because I don't think there's any. Well, I don't know. Hobart embargo forces rationing. Trade embargo. Judge comes down on youth. Yes, here here. Plans to end violent crime in the East Park block have met with link approval. Judge Chutney. <laughs> The man behind the new laws described the crackdown as long overdue. And delicatessen sold recycled produce. Ugh. 
analysis showed that the burgers contained an un unacceptably high amount of human waste. This is a nasty place to live. Nasty. Oh, I just went on to personal retina scan failed. Well, obviously I've got a bloody eye. So we can't get into security services yet. Oh, damn. Hmm. We have to find a way to do that soon. However, I think that's going to be it for this episode. So, until next time, thank you for watching, and goodbye.